hi guys happy 20 you know it's the dough for 10 of them so this is gonna go into the This part of my life is called I'm selective. I'm selective about what I need, what I learn, the places I go, and the people I intermingle with. I'm selective about my language. I'm selective with my conversations. I'm selective with my energy. And I'm selective about what entertains me. This part of my life means I have a choice. This part of my life means growth and expansion. This part of my life is when you know better, you do better. This part of my life is I'm good. And you? Hi, guys. Happy 2024. <laughs> I still can't believe that we are in 2024. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Katie and I am glad to have you here with me today. It's another vloggy vlog and <laughs> it's the new year and um, you know, we are starting afresh with content that is very relatable this year i hope um yeah so welcome to my channel 
if you haven't been here before i appreciate you stopping by and watching this video um it's the new year um do you guys um have you guys done your vision boards yet um you know your 12 week preparation and so on i'm reading this new book it's called the 12 week plan something like that i'm going to put the book on the screen it's really interesting and um i've never planned for a year like this one before uh not that i'm doing anything different but i just want to see better results and that's what i'll be doing this year 2024 um yeah i've done my vision board already um you know i've put in things that i Things that i really hope to achieve this year um you know and so on so yeah and um i can show you an example of what how i created my vision board the reason why i was even actually talking about the vision board is it's also been in my mind lately as well you know uh reading the word um you know in habakkuk 2 uh when it said you know uh write your vision make it plain so that who sees it may run with it uh, so that scripture has been you know heavy in my mind lately that you know let me put out my plans and make it plain on paper so as well as every time when i you know look at my phone i see my vision board and i'm reminded of all the work that i want to put in all the things that i want to achieve and so on um so also if you haven't maybe done your own vision board or written down your goals I will encourage you to do that uh, and put it in a place whereby you know that you always see it so that you are encouraged as well to work on those goals um you know this year because um when we see it the more we are encouraged to actually want to reach the goals that we have set for ourselves um the vision board that i did in 2021 i actually crushed all my goals in there i kid you not i crushed all the goals because it was on my laptop screen saver and I, I could see those goals every day i could see my vision board every day and every time i was reminded of the promises that i've made for myself you know and i was working towards towards them um and if you follow me on my socials you know that I, I i did graduate actually last year that was one of the goals that i had written down in 2021 um which i really really crushed um i was working full-time studying full-time but your girl did it um it was one of those who you know that congratulation pat at the back uh for myself so that's that's why as well this year I was like you know let me do this vision board again last year i didn't do it honestly and last year the things that i i told myself they were at the back of my mind that i wanted to achieve i didn't really um uh, finish you know doing that i know that time is not measured by by how fast we get to those goals um but it's also encouraging when you know when you you want to do something and you actually achieve it so that's why yeah so yes so if you haven't done your vision boards yet please do or write down your goals and that's that yeah um i just wanted to officially open this vlog and say that hey besties you're welcome um and thank you so much for being here <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm back. This is all that I got into the cupboard. So, lunch box, safety stuff, whole best because no peanuts at school. Um, this rice um, pasta for their lunch boxes for spaghetti. This is what I got. Let me just be putting them away as I'm talking to you guys. So. I'll propose flour and I want to bake uh, some banana bread and oatmeal um, for their sandwiches. This is what take a breast. Then I got Cajun chicken as well. Um, beef sausages. So we don't do pork in our mouthfuls. And I want to try this, the biscuits. You know, it's it's a dough for 10 of them. So this is gonna go into the oven. I also got the kiss from juice. It's only my 
my, my, my youngest son that takes juice to school so bad. Some tuna for the summer juice. Also got some grapes, apples. Uh, I got this meat meatballs because I want to make a uh, pasta meatballs for them sometime this week. Then I got garlic, ginger, lemon, orange, oranges, I think I've shown you guys that, onions, bananas, more pasta, digestive cookies, um, more cereal, Some muffles as well, frozen ones, granola, these are all the breakfast, um, the breakfast stuff, oatmeal, and I'm gonna put this away. really busy and it's cold it's freezing it's minus 12 today and it feels like it's minus 30 honestly my ears the wind was like blowing and i could feel my ears like almost dead into ice and then i had to stop to try and put gas then but I, I i took my my mittens my gloves with uh so it wasn't so bad so yeah today's sunday so it's sunday reset and that's the haul that I got for, for the kids' lunchbox stuff. Um, yeah, and that's that's everything. I'm going to do their laundry, pack up their laundry, and prepare the, their school clothes for this week. And that's it for today. So see you guys. I'm talking home, nobody knocks. I'm